Hey, you working from home? Why not protect your sensitive data with an extra layer of security at expressvpn.com slash funhouse. Hello, guys. Welcome to the startup company business boot camp. Oh, Ryan, yes. thank you. I see that you dress for the occasion. Guess that's why I'm dressed up. And Elise, Elise are you wearing camo? Well, I'm wearing sweats because I'm at home and I'm comfortable. And I'm wearing three quarter sleeves. It's not professional. Ryan, are you wearing rainbow suspenders? You gotta have something to keep my pants up. He's not wearing pants. There's no way. <laughs> so I found this game on Steam called Startup Company and I thought I'd get the best of the best to help me create my own business and, and yeah. skyrocket us out of 2020. Let's crunch some numbers. Uh, we gotta come up with a name. This is where I need you guys to get, you know, really put your brain juices to to work here and mm. come up with a company name like what is our company about what is our uh doesn't matter none of the see this is the first it doesn't matter what your company about it's what your company <sighs> presents it's how you present yourself so we it doesn't it matter what a you name make, is very important do. for the marketing of a company okay it's going to be the first thing that our customers see and hear and and absorb company so it's got to be called like queef or something yes yeah, have to be like queef or queefo Quifo. I like Quifo. Like, I like Quifo. Quifo. Yeah, and it's the kind of thing where like the F is capitalized for no reason. Okay, but the okay. Q is lowercase? Quifo. Quifo. Exactly. <laughs> yeah, Perfect. I like that. This is what business is all about. It's not about the product. It's not about how much money you bring in and how much money it's you spend. It's about all of that. CEO. What's his name? Well, I mean, if we want to, I mean, I'm just going to put it out here. Mohinder, if we want it to be successful. Or Steve Jobsgeberg. Mohinder Jobsgeberg? Mohinder Jobsgeberg. Yeah, I like that. Oh, Jobsgeberg. Yeah, we need a backstory, we need an avatar. I mean, he's probably like design, probably, right? Oh yeah, I feel like coming from a design background is so sexy. Sexy, yes. Mm -hmm. Okay, it's queefo.com. Honestly, com is pretty normy. Like we're kind of trying to do a next level, like elite website. Aren't there those cool dot dot weird things like dot? What about queefocom.com? I like that. Here's where we pick what kind of, pla is it a dating? Platform? Okay, so so th so here we go. What are we making here? We we have all the different options. Honestly, honestly, we could close our eyes and kick it, pick anything. It doesn't matter. Dating, Quifocom is about people finding love. Okay, sure. I Until it isn't, and then we pivot. <laughs> all right, great. Everyone knows you spend that venture capital on the most big, expensive space you can. No, you buy low and you sell high, James. Have you learned nothing from Dragon's Den? I'm sorry, Ryan, but how many failed businesses have you worked at? Because I've worked at plenty. The only ones I've I've started are failed ones, okay? I know about failed businesses, okay? Remind me again, Lindsay. Where was the Machinima offices located? West Hollywood. West Hollywood, one of the most expensive neighborhoods in all of Los Angeles. How's that business doing now? The people who started the company are rich beyond your wildest imaginations. That's what business is. I hired a lead developer. They're gonna take care of merging components and together into modules, whatever that Did means. Did you comparison shop that? Nice plant, Lindsay. Thank <laughs> you, thank you. We lost money. It's okay. okay. You gotta, you gotta, you gotta, you doesn't gotta spend matter. money to make money. Yeah, doesn't okay. matter. It's not okay, your money. Right. It's not you. your money. Thank you. Who cares? Is this a channel where we yes and? <laughs> oh, we need desks for the other people. Let's get another desk in here. Oh, Landon Kelly, beginner, eighty-seven percent speed. We need people that believe in Quifo Corp. <laughs> Let's give him a three hundred dollar monthly salary and a four thousand dollar signing bonus. He was offended. Who the fuck are you, Landon? Get the fuck out of here. You guys are creating such a terrible reputation for this business. Don't even want to think about the glass door reviews. <laughs> What's a good monthly salary? Whatever, drag it all the way to the right. Are you shitting me? Here's the thing, Ryan. Once they start hearing how much we're paying, the other devs from other places are going to be coming to us begging for jobs. This is how it works. You're sucking up our runway money, okay? We're not going to have any time to hire new people when, when, when right. Landon's going to get all of it. Adele Berry is a beginner researcher, 49 years old. We're not going to find any. This is a diamond in the She's rough. She's getting 10K a month now, so yeah, for sure. Let's commit her. Lindsay, you need to get something cool in here, like a bar. Shuffleboard. Can you get a shuffleboard? Let me look. You should get um, some t-shirts made up. There's a ping pong table, but we That's need 1,500 research points, and we have six. Okay. So we got to go we ham on the research. That should be our goal. Our, our our first goal as a company is to get enough research to, uh, points to get a ping pong table. Now you're learning, Ryan. You're getting it. Ryan, what does it say on the front of your notebook there? Uh, this is my note to, about ping pong. Where is Adele? Uh, Adele is right here. It's just because it's 830, so they're oh. not working right now. I know what time it is. Why aren't they working? Sleeping Quifo, eating Quifo, thinking Quifo, dreaming Quifo. I actually think that, in my opinion, 
a lot of people don't like to do this at their company, but I think I, I, I encourage only inter-office relationships. Oh, absolutely. Keep it in the ecosystem. Exactly. So I'm looking now for a developer. 6,000. Bitch, what been, a bitch, dude. Lindsay, you go 4,500. What kind of woman has the balls to counter offer? <laughs> You take what you're what you're offered, and you accept graciously. Oh, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> hey, James and Ryan, let me ask you this question. Yeah, have you ever negotiated for less money? <laughs> <laughs> no. Oh, speaking of which, Ryan, I wanted to talk to you about how much you're getting paid at Funhouse. Oh, okay, please. Yeah, let's talk about that. It's a little too much, so I'm just wondering if you can come down a bit and really help us out. Think of Jacob. Why am I thinking of Jacob? It's just, well, Jacob has a cat. Jacob and... does have a cat. Please don't. Just think on it and come back to us with a lower number. Okay? Yeah. You you know what? Ball's in your court. Just give us the lower number. Look, all right. Y'all know I don't have any leverage. I'll, I'll take whatever you offer me. Let's Great. Just go. Love to hear it. We need more employees. Um, we shouldn't just be looking for the discount employees. We need a rock star, okay? I mean, you should be out there trying to sell your company. We have zero new Jeets. <laughs> what is a Jeet? Jeet. It's a jitter. What is a jitter? No one's cheating about the business. <laughs> oh. I'm seeing a lot of rejeets. <laughs> oh, rejeets count. Why is she taking forever to research everything? What? This Four words for you. Viral marketing. Do it. We can't do any marketing yet because we have nothing to feature. When has that ever stopped anyone? We need to look for hot mean? singles in our area. Yeah. Are you saying that we need to look for employees on the Quifo app? That's a great idea. That's a great idea. You yeah. get people to sign up for the Quifo.com app, which uh -huh. allows them to be considered for Quifo.com employment. It's like trying to work at LinkedIn. Interesting. And that's how we get our employees to date. Mm -hmm. I um uh, dated someone that worked for Tinder, and we fit, we met on Tinder, and it always kind of made me go, hmm. Wait, that's... wait. Do you think that? Do you think that they exploited insider info to get you to fall in love with them? That was the other thing. I'd be talking to them. I go, "Do you? Are you just saying this thing that we have in common because because you see my Tinder algorithm, or do you really love Guar?" <laughs> 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 and did it work out? No. We got five thousand bucks, guys. We're making money. Not yet. <laughs> well, there's also two new Jeets. <gasps> we have Jeets. Ooh, upgrade. Get to work, you little shit. Fucking sitting around. You don't get a bonus. Lindsay, what's the company health? We are down a lot of money. Scale money. one to ten. Mm, two. Two okay. being That's not bad. The, like one being the best we could do. This or? is really overwhelming. I think it would really help our image if you wrote up some sort of formal uh, jeet that the work life balance is out of whack at our company, but we are in the process of changing it. And then all the people that work there can read it and go, what are you talking about? You're not doing anything. They send out, we send out emails. And then we lay them off. What is that? So bad news. This company is in very bad shape. Johnson Invest has decided to give the company one last investment. Great. 100000 Oh, thank Ooh. goodness. All right. Lindsay, take yes. 75000 into an offshore account. Take the twenty five. invest in small minor improvements. Or give herself a raise. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. She just keeps the 75, so that way when it all goes to shit, because this isn't going to work, we know. This is not good business practices. Now Ryan's <laughs> the better business bureau. <laughs> yeah. James, are you sure that you're making decisions in Quifo's best interest? Are you are you from a rival company? No, I am absolutely not from rival. I have the best interest of Quifo, the brand. Well, hang on a second, because Ryan might be on something here. I saw your business card on your desk, and it didn't oh say God. Quifo. It said O'Queef. O'Queef? You you work at O'Queef's? Are you shitting me? The rival Irish company, because it's a tax haven. So I started O'Queef in Ireland. Corporate James, tax. you have to make a decision right now. Are you a Quifo or an yeah, O'Queef? I'm an O'Queef. Oh, I don't have any of these other things. I've got lots of database components. <laughs> Ah, <laughs> oh, database. <laughs> That's how, uh, Wait, now, Lindsay. Now you're speaking terms. Lindsay, that I are you <laughs> are, are you <laughs> moonlighting at O'Queef as well? Uh, database. Oh no. I don't know how to uh, play this game. I I was wondering if you didn't know how to play this game. I've been watching you play this game. It doesn't look like you know how to play this game. Um. I'm just trying to get a website. So far, you've bought desks, right? That's about it, and hired people to sit at them. Here, James, you. You, you can play it, James. <laughs> if you're doing what you love, which is starting businesses and then selling those businesses for millions of dollars. You never work a day in your life. But sometimes I feel like if you do what you love, you have no separation. Between yeah. Your, your hobbies and your job. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, here we go. Features. Now we can add a feature. Oh, podcast ads. 
podcast oh, ads. Podcast. Oh, you're right. You're right. Here's the thing. Start a second business. We buy ads from ourselves. It's hand to mouth. Hand to mouth. That's a great idea. That's a phrase you've heard? Great I've heard is hand to mouth. Okay. So that's what we're doing with this is business term. Hand to mouth. <laughs> Hands. Hand to mouth. Write mouth. that down, Ryan. In your mouth. Hands in mouth. Somebody jeeted about us. Henry Hart says, I don't know about Quifo <laughs> It's a nice concept, but it just lacks features. Hashtag Quifo Go fuck yourself, Henry Hart. What? This is exactly, this is the best marketing Any we could hope for. press is good press. Let's find these trolls. Holy cow. Fry them. You guys might actually have a shot. I say you guys, because like, I always have Oqueef if I need okay. it. Please tell us what they do right. We don't know what we're doing. All right, I'll tell you guys about the secret. I'll tell you guys yes. about the secret. Yes, yes. It's going to be a chat network where you, you stick a device in your nose and in your mouth. And people queef in your mouth? And then you can taste, you can taste and smell the people on the other line. Oh. Yeah. People will see someone, see a picture of someone, they'll chat with them online, and then when they finally go to meet each other, they go, ugh, that person stunk. Gotcha. So this allows oh. us to completely bypass. That. Instant connectivity, you'll never queef alone. You'll never queef alone. You'll never queef alone. That's great, that is great. This is our competitive advantage. Lindsay, you're doing a lot over there. Yeah, I'm really, now I'm Now I'm going. There's a new Jeet. Oh, great Cupid has offered Ann Becker a significantly higher salary. Do you want to? You can't fucking take Ann. They're poaching oh, wait, our people. Is Oakley that... poaching our, our person? Oh my oh. God, dude. We got to slow down. I can't believe that she would abandon me. We did so much for her. We brought her into this world. We got to kill her. Now, but remember, we got that 100K loan, and if we don't pay off, we are going to have to file for bankruptcy. Who cares? Bankruptcy is a free pass out. Once you <laughs> file bankruptcy, there's not. what are they going to do? Throw this, the business uh, in jail? We tried. It's a good idea. I want to know what your company is worth. Oh, Where's it's negative. Red? Okay, we got to get that up. We got to get your spending up, I think is the problem. Oh, look at that. You made $250,000. It was the loan. I know, but it's money. We need, we we should do the Netflix model. I mean, look, they spend like $12 billion a year on original content. There's no fucking way a bunch of subscribing pays for that. How are they paying for anything? Nobody knows, but it's successful. That's what we need to uh, live up to is Netflix. They just spend money to not make money, but to just uh -huh. be cool. We need the Stranger Things of online dating apps. Yes. What is that? I guess it's a dating app that harkens back to a simpler time. Dating in the 80s? Um, um, yeah, big hair. Big hair. Up here, down there. Underwear that you can see that goes up the hips. 17-year-old uh, girls that look like they're 32. Uh-huh. What else happened in the 80s? Malls? Maybe we should oh. open a brick and mortar Quifo com yes. shop. Quifo brick and mortar. Cold War. Cold War, yeah. Bring that back. Global <sighs> disarmament. The jeets are gonna come flowing in. The team in the office wants a whiteboard. <gasps> oh, they want a whiteboard? Okay, we can get a That's whiteboard. Great. great thinking. It's too expensive. We don't have money. When can we get our ping pong table? How close are we to ping pong? Not that close. It's far away, yeah. Ooh, milestone. Milestone. Good job, Lindsay. And it made you five thousand dollars, which goes right into your pocket as CEO. Ooh! Now we can advertise our web page. Look, cause it's a smiling face. I went oh, nine dude. million reach conversion Ooh. rate. Business oh will be a boom. That's how it goes. We need women on the site. Female fifty plus. It's just a bunch of dudes. Well, I okay. I, I don't know that fifty plus is queefing the most, but they queef the hardest. That's true. Oh, then that's all that matters. I just want y'all to know that. My dad would be very proud of us right now. He's a business guy. He wanted me to be a business guy. I've seriously disappointed him by becoming mm -hmm. a YouTube editor, but right now I feel like I'm doing a little bit of both. So thank you for 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 letting me uh, live, letting my dad live vicariously through. That's all beautiful. Of us. Can we put up a dedication screen now to Ryan's dad, dedicating yeah, his video to him? Yep. Love you, Dad. It's for you. Quifo's for you, Dad. <laughs> this is Rhett your Haley. father's legacy. <laughs> Almost yeah. there. All right, guys. Well, it's been fun, but I actually, um, another company needs me and- Which company? No, which one? I'll give you a $3,000 bonus. Splooge Sploochcom. Splooge Com. We can't compete with Splooge Sploochcom. I have a great have amazing offer capital. at Splooge Com. You'll never work in this industry again. You're dead to us. Remember, you signed that friend, friend DA, okay? Are they hiring at Splooge Com? You know what? I'll let you know. To quote the President of the United States, you're fired now. Fired.
Almost there, guys. I took out that mm -hmm. second loan for this ping pong table. This is Ryan. This is a four hundred thousand dollar ping pong table. Oh All my right, god, guys. we're close. Eight points away. Points are slowing down. They're slowing down. Here they go. Here we go. Yeah, we, yeah. Did it. we did ping it. Pong. That's right. We didn't need James. We're successful Quee without him. Quee fo, quee fo, quee fo. And Quee-fo. now we're gonna put in our ping pong table. Awesome. This, this is this gonna is... increase productivity tenfold. Yes. I know it. Exactly. This is the most important decision oh. you can make. Is and you can only play it against the wall like Forrest Gump. So <laughs> I think I can retire now. Yeah, let's do it. Yes. Pull the trigger. It's been a long journey with many ups and downs. Mostly ups. I wouldn't say that, but let's take a look at how it went. We're uh, poor? That can't be. Wait, it's filling up. It's filling up. Oh. Yeah, it's going to go. It's just going to take a while, probably. You will survive. But <laughs> <laughs> this bullshit. I'm going to see if O'Queef is hiring. Um, hey, Lindsay, I really uh, admire what you've done with the company, but I think me and Elise are going to um, go go to O'Queef's, kind of see what they have to offer, and I uh, I wish you well at, at, at Queef Co. Yeah, uh, Lindsay, right? you really, you built this company from the ground up. Yeah. Namaste. Namaste. I don't even know anything that you guys said. O'Queef, I need to talk to you. <laughs> 